Is it time to buy or sell Palantir stock? In this video, we will delve deeply into Palantir. Our initial report was published on our website on Wednesday, the 21st of August, 2024, and now we are here to provide you with an even more thorough analysis. Remember to subscribe, hit the like button, and turn on the notification bell to stay updated on our latest analysis. You don't want to miss any crucial updates that could impact your investments. Enhance your trading decisions by trying our newly launched AI stock analysis tool powered by GPT-4 at stockinvest.us. Tap into the power of AI and receive free price predictions and in-depth analysis for any one of 25,000 companies worldwide today. Please note that this video is for informational purposes only and should not be considered financial advice. Since the 8th of August in 2024, our system has classified Palantir as a hold or accumulate, resulting in a score of zero. Now, let's examine the stock's performance during this time frame. Over this period, the stock has exceeded our expectations, achieving a gain of approximately 11.13% since we initially suggested purchasing Palantir 10 days ago. This equates to an average return of about 1.11% per day since it was designated as hold or accumulate. A score of zero signifies that our system predicts significant volatility and risk for the upcoming trading day. In light of the recent developments, we are unable to ascertain the stock's next movement as it could proceed in either direction. The stock has broken through a wide and strong upward short-term trend, indicating an even stronger rate of increase ahead. Any pullback will now find support at the ceiling of the current trend which was previously broken at $32. This level may present a second opportunity for a significant gain. According to fan theory, $38.09 will be the next possible peak in the trend, acting as a resistance level that may prove difficult to surpass on the first attempt. The current three-month trend suggests a potential change of approximately 41.76% over the next three months, with possible returns ranging between 12.89% and 39.42%. In terms of the 12-month trend, it indicates a change of about 69.95% over the next year, with potential returns between 27.14% and 70.31%. This would translate to a price range of approximately $41 and 37 cents to $55.42 after a year. Our latest daily update for Palantir includes the headline, Evaluation of Palantir Stock Downgraded After the Last Trading Session. The Palantir stock price increased by approximately 0.681% on the last trading day, which was Wednesday, the 21st of August, 2024, it rose from $32.32 .32 to $32.54. During that trading day, the stock experienced fluctuations of 2.19%, moving from a low of $31.97 to a high of $32.67. The price has risen in eight of the last 10 days and has increased by 23.63% over the past two weeks. Notably, trading volume declined by 2 million shares on the last day, with a total of 38 million shares exchanged, amounting to approximately $1.23 billion. It is important to consider that declining volume alongside rising prices may signal divergence, potentially indicating early warnings of changes in the coming days. Over the past 52 weeks, the highest price for the stock was $32.75, while the lowest price was $13.68. Currently, the price is 0.64%, or 21 cents, below the 52-week high, and 27.69%, or $12.46, below the all-time high reached on January 27, 2021, when the price hit $45. Palantir Technologies, trading under the symbol PLTR, is currently witnessing varied market dynamics as it integrates further into the artificial intelligence sector. 
Recent reports indicate that while AI stocks have experienced significant volatility, Palantir's strong fundamentals position it to capitalize on this momentum. The company has garnered considerable attention following its robust second quarter earnings and a notable partnership with Microsoft, underscoring its pivotal role in leveraging AI across multiple sectors. Expanding use cases for artificial intelligence have sparked upward movement in PLTR's stock price, signaling a potential bullish trajectory. Moreover, with the current market environment favoring growth stocks, investor sentiment remains positive, enhancing Palantir's appeal as a growth investment. As PLTR continues to solidify its position as an AI frontrunner, the implications for its stock price in both the short and long term are promising. In the near term, increasing investor interest could drive the stock higher, particularly as market conditions stabilize. Over the long haul, if Palantir successfully expands its offerings and captures a larger market share in AI, it stands to benefit significantly, potentially leading to sustained price appreciation. Analyst Ratings On Wednesday, the 7th of August, 2024, it was reported that Wedbush assigned PLTR a buy rating, accompanied by a hold action. On the same day, RBC Capital designated PLTR with an underperform rating and also recommended a hold action. On Tuesday, the 6th of August, 2024, Goldman Sachs gave PLTR a neutral rating, along with a hold action. On that same Tuesday, Bank of America Securities issued PLTR a buy rating, also suggesting a hold action. Lastly, on Tuesday, the 6th of August, 2024, Raymond James evaluated PLTR and assigned it an outperform rating with a hold action. Analysts have assigned Palantir stock a general neutral rating. They classify the price-to-earnings ratio as strong sell and the price-to-book ratio as strong sell. In terms of return on investment, analysts have rated the stock as strong buy. The following signals have been identified for Palantir. The Palantir stock presents buy signals from both short-term and long-term moving averages, indicating a positive outlook for the stock. Additionally, there is a general buy signal from the relationship between these two indicators, as the short-term average is positioned above the long-term average. In the event of downward corrections, there will be support from the lines at $31.72 and $28.33. A drop below either of these levels would trigger sell signals. A buy signal was generated from a pivot bottom point on Monday, the 5th of August, 2024. And thus far, the stock has increased by 35.08%. Further increases are expected until a new top pivot is identified. Moreover, there is a buy signal from the three-month moving average convergence divergence, or MACD. Notably, volume declined on the last trading day despite price gains. This divergence between volume and price may serve as an early warning. Therefore, it is advisable to monitor the stock closely. Here are some additional signals that may interest you. Moving average convergence divergence, buy signal. Pivots, buy signal from 13 days ago. Bollinger, buy signal from 13 days ago. Short-term moving average, buy signal from 13 days ago. Long-term moving average, buy signal from 13 days ago. The relationship between the short and long moving averages, buy signal from nine days ago. When we examine the 12-month chart, we observe Short moving average, buy signal from 11 days ago. Long term moving average, buy signal from 56 days ago. The relationship between the short and long moving averages, buy signal from 44 days ago. For further signals, be sure to visit our page at stockinvest.us. Let's discuss support, risk, and stop loss for Palantir. On the downside, the stock finds support just below today's level with accumulated volume indicating support at $29.28 and $28.67. There is an inherent risk when a stock tests a support level. If this level is breached, the stock may decline to the next support level. In this case, Palantir has support just below today's level at $29.28. Should this level break, the next support from accumulated volume would be at $28.67 and $26.59.
This stock can experience significant movement throughout the day, indicating a level of volatility. With a broad prediction interval suggested by the Bollinger Band, it is classified as high risk. Over the past day, the stock fluctuated by seven-tenths of a dollar between its high and low, which represents a 2.19% change. During the previous week, the stock has shown an average daily volatility of 3.19%. Before we dive into the potential trading levels for Palantir, let us first discuss some essential fundamental data. First, we have the price to earnings ratio, commonly referred to as the P-E ratio. This important metric measures a company's current share price in relation to its earnings per share. A notably high P.E. ratio suggests that the stock may be overvalued. However, it is not unusual for technology companies or those with substantial market potential to exhibit such elevated ratios. In other news, the upcoming earnings report for the third quarter of 2024 is anticipated on the 7th of November, 2024. Analysts' consensus estimates are set at $0.09. Cents. It is important to monitor these figures as they can significantly influence stock prices. Now let's discuss some potential day trading levels for Palantir. There is no significant resistance from accumulated volume above, indicating that the stock could move upward swiftly under the right conditions. In this scenario, you may want to enter a position and use volume to decide when to exit. On the downside, Palantir encounters its first support level at $29.28. If this support level holds, it could present a favorable entry point, anticipating a rebound. The combined average rating for Palantir from multiple analyst sources is neutral. Now let's examine some recent insider trades. On August 16, 2024, Taylor Ryan D., executed an insider sale of 160,000 shares of employee stock option, right to buy. On the same day, Taylor Ryan D. also performed an insider purchase of 160,000 shares of Class A common stock. Additionally, on August 16, 2024, Taylor Ryan D. conducted another insider sale of 160,000 shares of Class A common stock. On August 12, 2024, Planishek Heather A., made an insider purchase of 20,000 shares of Class A common stock. On the same day, Planishek Heather A executed an insider sale of 20,000 shares of Class A common stock. Analyzing the 100 most recent insider trades, we find that the insider power is negative, with a ratio of negative 61.68. In total, insiders purchased 4,377,114 shares and sold 19,253,830 shares over the last 100 trades. Our recommended stop loss is set at $31.15, which reflects a decrease of 4.28%. This stock experiences significant daily fluctuations, which contributes to a higher level of risk. The relative strength index, calculated over the last 14 days, stands at 76, further elevating the risk factor. However, there is a buy signal indicated by a pivot bottom identified 21 days ago. Is Palantir stock a good buy? Palantir exhibits several positive indicators. However, we do not find these sufficient to classify it as a buy candidate at this time. Instead, it is advisable to view it as a hold candidate with the option to accumulate more shares while we await further developments. Due to minor weaknesses observed in the technical landscape, we have adjusted our analysis from a buy recommendation to a hold or accumulate stance since our last evaluation. After examining the volatility and price movements from the most recent trading day, our systems indicate that the current price is overvalued. For trading on Thursday, August 22nd, we anticipate that Palantir will open lower by approximately 14 cents, beginning at a price of $32.39. We remind you that trading involves a high risk of losing money, and it is advisable to consult with a financial advisor before buying or selling any securities. Your investment decisions should not rely solely on stockinvest.us. By utilizing this information, 
you acknowledge and accept responsibility for your own investment choices. This is our current view of the stock. Do you agree or disagree? We invite you to comment below and share your thoughts. What is your target for the stock? Remember to like and subscribe. We wish you successful trading and hope you have a wonderful day from all of us here at Stock Invest.